Okay, Capricorn, this is your journal reading. Show me journal energy. Journal reading for Capricorn. We had a Seven of Swords. The Hangman. The Ten of Wands. Now... Capricorn, someone could be accusing you all of something with the Seven of Swords. And then we had a hangman. You could or could not be trying to delay something. You, you could or could not be trying to delay something. You could be trying, you could, I feel Capricorn that you all could be trying to delay something here. Ace of Wands. Death. Or you could be trying to stop something, delay something. Seven of Pentacles. Eight of Swords. Empress, what are your options? You're looking at your options. You're trying to figure something out. If something could be done so that something can't happen. If you really had the power to stop something. Ten of Swords. Yeah, you're trying to stop something or delay something. Star, four of pentacles. Could you want to hold on to something? Some of you can want to hold on to money. You're not willing to release some money. But you, you may not know if you have the right to hold on to it or not. I feel it's, But I feel that it's yours. Seven of swords, you can feel that it's being stolen from you. You had the seven of swords twice. It could be deception on two people's part. Okay, like, I feel that something, Capricorn, it, it belongs to you. But maybe you're supposed to give it up, but it's yours. Okay, but then somebody tricks you out of giving it up. Or try, they try to trick you. And you're trying to delay or stop someone to figure out if you can delay <laughs> I'll stop something from happening, Capricorn. Let's see. You feel that you have the right to it, and they feel that they have the right to it. You're not just going to release the right just because they feel like that. Nine of Cups, Queen of Cups, and the Sun. You don't know how the outcome is going to be, but you're, you're going to attempt to, to delay something. It doesn't mean, Capricorn, that you don't want to give it completely. It means that you want to give it the way that you want to give it. They could, somebody else could feel that you're, you don't want to give it completely. Three of Swords. Three of Wands. You're waiting to hear back. You may have checked, communicated about something about this, and you're waiting to hear back. Like that is what I'm getting. <laughs> okay. Capricorn, you all can feel that somebody's trying to take something away from you all. Let's see. Show me Capricorn. And you and you you made a, a <laughs> Capricorn, some of you may have made an unexpected but surprising stance. You had a chariot. I don't know if this outcome is gonna be successful or not. I don't think for you it's really about that. I don't know. It can depend on what you call this. You want to, you may be wanting to, you want to be in charge of maneuvering something and how something unfolds. You want to be in control of that. You want to be at the driver's seat of how that happens. Whether or not you can be, who knows? I don't even think you're sure like that, but you know, show me, and you have cancer here with the chariot. Eight of cups, the moon, 
Two of Wands. Some of you could be traveling, relocating. Also, this could be about something major that you're trying to purchase. It could be land or property with the Two of Wands. You could have your eye on something or trying to hold on to something or get something. Acquire something here. Show me Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising. Or keep something or control something. I don't know. But whatever it is, if you're trying to control something, you have the right for ownership for it. This could be an accountant, underwriter with the hermit, an attorney. We had a two of ones. You're blocking a path. And then we had a fool. Somebody may have had to try to trick you out of it. It's like, because you had that seven of swords twice. And cancer had something like that. Like somebody's going to try to be deceptive or pull one over on you. But you're not sure if this could be pulled over on you or if, you could be, if it could be done because of the circumstances. But you're going to find out. And you have someone that can directly tell you. Now, that's a part of this that's in a position of authority, hermit, accounting. Okay. Now, you may be, you're, you're, you're trying to block something from happening. Like, and then you have somebody around you try to pull one on you that think you're naive. Or you, you let somebody know that you're not naive. That you know something that they already know and may have thought you didn't. Okay. You're trying to stop something or control something. You're even holding the wolf. You're, you're trying to stop something or control something. You kind of want something your way. You're not sure if it can happen, but you're going to find out. And it's not going to take long for you to find out because you, you know you, you have somebody to ask that's a major player in it. That can actually stop something. It, they can actually stop something. Okay. Like this, okay, let's see. Because it will be a part of this. But you're not sure if it can be stopped, but you feel that it should be. Because you feel that you have, you have the direct decision, clear decision, strong victory, strong. So you, and you don't know how that decision is going to go out, but go because the details around it. But you know that if you can't stop something, you won't participate in it. You won't be controlled. You, you, you're only going to do whatever, 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 after that. You know how you interact with the situation after that. Let's see. This is communication that is going to come to you about if you can stop something. It's going to be the final word. It's the final decision. If you can stop something or not. It, it, but you're trying to stop it, but then you had to retain counsel on if you can stop it. Okay, you're going to get the answer. You're going to get the truth. But you know, Capricorn, okay, if you can stop it, great. And you're going to do whatever, how you want to do it. But if, if you can't, you're not going to be cooperative. <laughs> your cooperation, your cooperation is going to be limited, Capricorn. Like that. Okay, let's see. Show me Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising. Show me Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, people. Judgment, Page of Swords. That, that could be you idea investigating if you could stop something judgment here romancing somebody could want it back in your life you don't want them show me capricorn sun moon rising you're not even focused on them somebody you're not even focused on you can be focused on other things show me capricorn sun moon rising we had an empress. That could be you all, the feminine energy, abundance. The nine of pentacles, this it could be about finances. This is the the the, the um, nine of pentacles is someone that is makes wise investments, good at growing finances, very practical, very grounded, good at contractual agreements and negotiating them. Focus on her abundance. Focus on her wealth. This could be, oh, oh, this is, oh, this is a woman that is wealthy. The Nine of Pentacles is financially well off, wealthy, financial resourceful. She, she's living in comfort. Nine of Pentacles is a card of comfort, and you, you, it's the Empress, the Four of Wands, Six of Cups. Past opportunities could be coming back, Capricorn. Somebody from the past can be thinking about you 
Or you could have had high hopes regarding someone from the past. Maybe wanting to marriage or get committed to them or something like that. Move in together. That's probably what you wanted. Some of you are already married. You could be buying a person's home with a partner. You're doing well financially. We had a five of wands. We had a half it. Five of swords. Knight of cups. If it's somebody from the past wanting you back romance, you don't want them. You probably already spoke your piece with this person and you're done with it. Like that. New people could be, somebody new could be coming in romantically. And it seems that there could be a lot of potential. And that six of cups would not be the past. It would be a soulmate or a past life person. That things could end quite positively with. With that four of wands. Someone that there's a lot of potential marriage, moving in together, those types of things. Okay, Capricorn, you're trying to... You're trying to stop something. You're wanting to know if you have the hyphen hermit on your side. Ace of Swords is you're going to get the communication and know shortly him. Show me this Five of Swords. Somebody could have tried to trick. Even if you were supposed to release it, somebody could have tried to trick you into doing that. By thinking that they, by knowing something that they thought you didn't know, but you know. And you can go straight to the person, another person, that can tell you that what can be stopped and can't be stopped. Show me the five of swords. Hey man, yeah, delays. Empress, twice. Five of Wands, conflict. That can be resolved or it can be escalated. It depends on what the answer you get or answer you get. Two of Cups. Ten of Swords. That's when that final decision comes in. We're going to answer that you need. Okay, with the Ten of Swords. So you can know what your next step is going to be. And then it's like rather quickly they can tell you. Okay. Show me this hyphen for... Capricorn. King of Pentacles. This is about finances. Or oh, this is you all, Capricorn. I don't like when people see a Earth, if they're doing a Capricorn, or even if they're doing an air sign reading and then the King of Swords come out. They're like, I wonder who that King of Swords is. Well, it would obviously be the air sign. Okay. The King of Pentacles is you all, Capricorn. We don't have to wonder who that is. To a lesser extent, it would be somebody else that be, could be a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rise, or somebody embodying that energy. But more than likely, it would be you. And you're dealing with finances. And you're dealing with the high thing. Like um, big business and corporations. Those types of things. When we had a Queen of Cups. A woman can be involved. That you're getting the answer from or the communication. She, she can know or a man can be involved that they can know. King of Cups, yeah, or a man can know. Or these are two partners, romantic, non-romantically. And this is about business with the high thing. And you're the king of pentacles, obviously, male or female. Okay, and these are practical matters. Show me... Two of so you're not moving. If you can't stop something, you're not gonna be. There's no. You're not gonna be in agreement with much. If you can't stop it, if you can stop, if you can stop something, you're gonna be Capricorn doing something the way you want to do it. You're you're not. You you made a decision. It's like. You could have blocked what somebody else was trying to do. You could be trying to block what they're trying to do. You could feel that they tried to trick you. And, and you're, you're getting outside from the half of the communication. Okay, Capricorn, that's your reading. I'm going to continue. The link is in the description box for this video per usual. I'm going to lay more spreads for you all. Another spread for you all and clarify the cards. Dig a little bit deeper here. Bye.